Hey guys, Davey at Next Level Fitness uh, and today's talk is just on, um, basically on when you're happy with the work that you do, then truly you'll succeed at what you're doing. So let me just explain that a little. Um, <clears throat> my daughter's now on a chore chart, okay? Well, however you think about chore charts, um, rewarding your kids, etc. that's not up for debate here. That's how we reward in our house, okay? Hard work gets rewarded. So she's got something that she's wanting to, to save up some money for. So if she does a few household chores every single day, um, therefore at the end of the week, she's going to get a pound for it. She's going to get a little bit of pocket money and she can save her money towards it. Now, one of the jobs she has to do is tidy the lounge, which initially she found quite unfair because it's not just her mess, it's her and her two-year-old brother's mess. But that's by the by, she's six and he's two. Um, one question I ask her, she, I've just been doing the dishes and she's come in and she said, Dad, can I go upstairs? And I said, well, just simple question, just tell me whether or not you're happy with it. Um, and she said, well, I, she says, I don't know. She says, are you happy with it? And I said, well, look, I'm not looking at the dishes right now. I said, you tell me if you're happy with it. So she went into the lounge and she picked up three more things. And then she came back and she said, now I'm happy with it. And I said, okay, brilliant. So as long as you're happy with it, you go upstairs. To be honest with you, I've just gone in the lounge and actually I, she's done a very, very good job. I'm very happy with it. Um, but how this equates back to you. Okay, so have you ever done a diet and you've hated every minute of doing it? Have you ever started a fitness regime, but you've just not got into it at all? Maybe it's the instructor, maybe it's the exercises that you're doing, maybe you just don't enjoy gyms, maybe you enjoy classes, you don't enjoy classes, whatever it might be, okay? You've been doing something that you've not agreed with. What's happened? You've given up. You've not given it your all, most importantly. Um, and then along the way, you've just ended up just giving it all in. Now, when you can get to the point of the same question I asked my daughter, are you happy with the work you've put in? So these days, even when you're actually on the right path and you feel like you're doing the right things, um, if you have a sneaky, I don't know, a, a sneaky donut that maybe pushes you over your calorie count, your macros, whatever for the day, or if you go out on a Saturday night and get lashed and you do nothing but feel guilty all day the next day for it, well, then you're not happy with your workload. Uh, it's quite simple. So in order to make sure that you're happy, when you can come to the end of the day, and okay, maybe you've got a glass of wine in front of you, but you can say, well, actually, I truly deserve that glass of wine. Maybe if you're not feeling too well and you need to not go to the gym that day, you can say, well, actually, do you know what? I've worked really hard and I do deserve a day off. When you can honestly say to yourself, I am happy with what I have done so far, then folks, there's nothing holding you back and you will succeed at any single one of the goals that you want to push in. Listen, thanks for watching. Um, as always, comment below um, or drop me a message or something um, and we can discuss things in truth further. Thanks for watching.